In this video, I'm going to go over another example of solving multi-step equations with variables on one side. On the right side of your screen, you can see that the steps are listed out there for you. Our first step is to draw a vertical line through our equal sign. So we can split our equation into two expressions. This will remind us that whatever we do to one side, we have to do to the other side of the equal sign. Step two says to distribute and then combine like terms. We're looking to see if we have any parentheses with multiple terms inside to see if we have a number in front that we want to distribute. And in this case, we do. We're going to multiply six by everything inside the parentheses. So we'll take six times one, which will give us six. And then we're going to take six times positive three X, which will give us positive 18 X. And then this positive six just drops down because it's outside of our parentheses. So we do not distribute to it. And then on the right hand side, we bring down negative 18. Now we're still not done with step two because it says, and then combine like terms. We can combine positive 18 X with positive six X. So the six just drops down. 18 X plus six X will give us positive 24 X. And then again, negative 18 drops down. So now we finish step two. Step three is if we have variables on both sides, which we don't, we only have a variable on the left. So I can cross that step out. Now we have a two step equation, so we can read and write the side of the equation starting with the variable. So in this case, our variable is X. So I would read this as X times 24 plus six. Now I wrote this at the bottom of the screen because that's where I have space. So now I'm going to work backwards using inverse operations to solve. So the last thing I read was plus six. So the opposite or inverse operation would be subtraction. So minus six on both sides. Positive six minus six equals zero. 24x drops down, and then negative 18 minus 6 gives me negative 24. I can cross out that step. So then my next step is times 24. So the inverse would be division. So divide by 24 on both sides. 24 divided by 24 will give me 1 x and then negative 24 divided by 24 will give me negative 1 and then using the invisible 1 rule on the left hand side I know 1x is the same thing as x so x equals negative 1 and that's your final answer but as always remember you can take your answer and substitute it back into the original equation to make sure that both sides are equal.